Hey guys, and welcome back to Project Zero, or Fatal Frame, depending on uh, your residence. Right, let me just set my monitor back to 4.3. There we go. Yeah, uh, it, this game definitely looks better in 4.3. Uh, stretched out to widescreen, it, it looks weird, man. Oh, I wish there was an easy way of setting these systems to 4.3. But unfortunately, once you run it through the capture card and all that lot, it just farts it out in stretched widescreen, which is not nice. But there we go. Okay, cool. Now this game is this game certainly feels like it runs at sixty frames a second as well. And I was thinking about this. A lot of PlayStation Two games and Dreamcast games uh, actually ran at sixty frames a second. What happened? <laughs> Seriously, what happened? Then we suddenly shifted to, we need them graphics, man. Graphics. Consoles became all about pumping out those graphics at a smooth cinematic 10 frames a second. But these games, apart from how horrible the, the game actually controls, which isn't the game's fault per se, it's the stupid developer decisions, but this game actually runs really smoothly it's really nice it's nailed tightly shut so we can't go that way we must have some way to go here because this room wouldn't have opened up for no reason and oh wait we've got the lighter haven't we yeah be, yeah ha, 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 ha. do we not have anything that we can do this there's a small door here but it's nailed shut i can't open it surely there's a way to open that there must be because it just it seems a bit odd Right, well, let's go use the lighter. Whoa, that was strange. I'm guessing we need to um, go light the lantern that we saw earlier. Uh, right, hang on. Was Ah, there's a door down here that we haven't been through as well. So let's go try that. Seems like a good idea. Yeah, there's a lot of modifications coming out for old consoles to add uh, HDMI ports to them as well. The only trouble is they require soldering, and they are obscenely expensive. Okay. I vaguely remember this room. Something in my feet. Herbal medicine. Yeah, we're going to need that, I think. I do remember this room. Oh boy. Well, that's not creepy at all, is it? Oof. Uh. <laughs> uh. Right. Now we have to face off against Tomato. Oh shit. Okay, this is. Whoa, we're probably gonna die here. Oh god, yeah, we Oh no! Right, that was useful. We had the mirror thing. Which saved us. There she is. She does? Right, let's give her a fucking warm welcome. Right, and another one. 70 damage. Get in. Get in. We really shouldn't have uh, used that mirror there. Fuck. Uh, there's something on the ground where the ghost stood. Only a little bit of audio has been used. Uh, I'm wondering if I should redo that fight, guys. Uh... Should I redo that? Because I don't want to lose that stone. Mm. Yep, I'm going to redo it. Alright, let's try that again, guys. But this time, let's use a herbal medicine. Because, I, 
guess we probably... Well, we got 10. Alright, let's see if we can do this, actually, without needing to use one. Come on. Right, let's give her one of those. I'm not going to worry too much. Right, let's give her that. Ooh. I think we got the zero... Sh no, we didn't get the zero shot, but... We did a lot of damage to her there. Holy crap. We just did that without taking any damage whatsoever. Uh, I'm happy with that, actually. Oh, man. Yeah, fuck using stuff if we don't have to. Uh, I, I, I'm going to watch my old footage back, like I said. Um, I think I really struggled with that fight somehow last time. A little girl in a white kimono keeps pleading to me. I can't keep my mind focused, but her voice rings in my head and won't leave me. But what does she want me to do for her? I can't even get out of this mansion anymore. Broken. Five pieces. The mirror. Uh, tell Mr. Takamine the way to break the curse. Right. Yeah, I don't think... Oh. There are buttons with characters. This device must open the door. There's engravings underneath, but it's gouged out. Can I only read some? I can just barely make up the chosen maiden purifies from the gouged out words. Now, I'm pretty sure that if we go into our items, I don't know if we can hold more than 10 of those. Uh, not sure. Right. I don't think I ever had 10, to be honest, in my other playthrough. Um, it was the research notes, I believe. Research notes five. Right. No, it wasn't actually that. I wish these were actually, like, you know, named. Like they were in Resident Evil. Because then you'd know what file you're looking for. At least roughly. They're all just called... Cool red notebook scrap probably looking in the wrong bit to be honest yeah maybe we want the scraps right that's what we want strangling ritual so uh i guess we need 3669 because that's the only other code we have so one and one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, cool. That actually is the right one. Where's this? But well, we've got the lighter though. Ah, oh shit. This is close to where I stopped uh, playing, and it got really hard. A little bit further on than this, I think. Um, I want to go try the lighter. Because I'm wondering if that's going to get us something good. I mean, I, I'm not 100% sure, but... Uh, unless that's something that we have to do. But I'm sure we need to light that lantern for reasons. There is a save point out there uh, in the room that we've just opened up, as we can see on the map. But I'm pretty sure there's a lot of nasty shit out there. Which we want to be a little bit careful about. Now, we might also bump into another ghost here. But, oh, hang on. Did we actually listen to the tape? Ah, uh, da, 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 da. Red tape four. Since we met that girl, I've seen many strange visions. All the ghosts in the mansion howl and scream at me. I don't think they'll ever let me out of this mansion. I don't even know how long I can hold on to my sanity. Anyway, I'm leaving this tape. If ever someone listens to this, please tell me what has happened to me. Well, 
Yeah, well, unfortunately, it ain't a dream. I got bad news for you, Jack. Oh. Is that always broken? Uh, well, I mean, it doesn't impede our progress, so. Right, let's go back to the save room. And I want to reload my film as well. We're going to save it. I can't believe how well I actually took that uh, woman out. That was really good. I know I struggled quite badly with that the first time around. Uh, no, that's not what we want to go. Come on, Titan. I know you've been up all day, but Jesus, man, get with the progress. Get with the progress. Get with the program. I can't even talk. Damn. The bloody hell's wrong with me. Ah, sleep deprivation. Yes. Okay. Yeah, this is the only problem with this game as well. You kind of get into the groove and, and into the controls and the way the game feels. And then you don't play it for a week. Right, let's reload. Reloading up to 30 exposures of, of film, yeah. Uh, yeah, so I'm not going to play this. After today, uh, I don't think I'm going to play this for a good long time. Uh, which is really sucky because um, I will lose what little skills uh, I have developed. But never mind, I suppose that's just video games for you. Now, I want to say this game hasn't been as difficult the second time round, uh, but, <laughs> but, um, I didn't struggle with this game, I don't think, until a certain point, and then the game just dialed up the difficulty massively. Uh, it, it was weird. Now, there was that door as well that we've got that has a hair, um, or it has hair wrapped around it. Now... I'm sure, I remember the first time around, I spent a long time trying to open that uh, door with the lighter. Now, of course, the lighter is not what we want, apparently. Now, uh, which one of these? I think it was this one that we need to light. Now, what does this do? Ooh, there's something inside the top part of the garden lantern. Black carving, a stone with a strange character carved into it. The reverse side has a plug. Right. Uh, did I get that before? Uh, I guess I did. Black carving. A black stone with a strange character. A plug protrudes from it. You cannot use this here. Well, I didn't expect that I would be able to use it here, but... Um, Hmm. Okay. And uh, unless that's one of the things that we jam into the doors. Oh, shit. Hello. Woman hanging. Oh. Ah, uh, fuck if I know. Strangulation ritual, maybe? Uh, oh, we've got enough. We've got enough points to upgrade. So, widens the capture circle, the range for capturing ghosts. That could be nice. But I like the idea of getting the speed maxed out as well. Speeds up the chart. Yeah. Right, max level. So, that will make our camera charge up as fast as it possibly can. Um... Yeah, like I said, you know, I'm not sure what's the most efficient way to level our character up, but I, just, I, you know, I'm guessing the fact that if we upgrade the basic moves, because they're the moves that are going to help us out in every single situation, um, and then we will save our special functions and special powers for later on. Oh, fuck. Female head going up the stairs, apparently. Oh, hello. Hello. You want to kiss? 
Get out of here. That was random. Yeah, not very strong. Well, we got a thousand odd XP for that, so I mean, sure, I'll take it. Definitely not taking the damage that we did. We did in the my original uh, playthrough, which I'm very happy about. Now, I wonder if we're going to find any more ghosts in here. Ooh. It's like blood dripping down. Well, there was blood dripping down. Monk in the into the dark. Yeah, we actually Okay, it's interesting. We do get um XP for those random ghosts as well. I didn't think we did. Okay. Get XP for damn near everything, which is actually quite nice. Right, so yeah, I remember this area being really quite tough. Cause uh from what I can remember, there's a lot of things. Spirit Stone, we'll have that bastard. Uh, let's reload the film. I don't think there's any limit on how much, how many times you can reload the film either. I think you can just, you know, go ham with that shit. Need to be careful as well, because I don't want to over uh, write a save and then have the game fuck up. Right, what have we got? Oh. Man in the back garden. That's tack of mine, isn't it? Stop taking photos, although it doesn't really matter because we have. Stop taking photos, you fool! You fool of a truck! Looks like an old well. There's a lid on it and I can't see inside. Well, that's silly, isn't it? Oh. Oh, I remember that. One second, guys. Right, let's try that again because. Right, man in the backyard. Yeah, I remember up there. That is a. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Can we get out of that, please? Thank you. There we go. Girl pleading. Right. Good stuff. Yeah, we're back up to like three odd thousand. Looks like an old well. Yeah, well, can we grab the thing that's on top of it, please? You know the big, right, blue tape one. Well, we haven't had got a blue tape before. Let's save it now we've uh, got the hard to get ghost. Save scumming for the win. We shall save and cheat our way through this game. Is it really cheating to save when you've got a save spot here? I don't think so. Right, okay. Uh, let's reload the film. And listen to our tape. So we've got a blue tape. I'm guessing the blue tape is Takamine's. Uh... No, they're actually items, aren't they? For some reason. Blue tape. September 12th, 320 PM. I know this sounds crazy, but there's something here besides us yes. in this mansion. I've seen it myself. It was a woman in a white kimono. Something is definitely happening here. Have we unknowingly awakened something? Or perhaps we've been lured here to die? Hmm. We don't sound too bothered by the fact that you've possibly been lured here to die. Okay. 
Okay, so I guess once you start showing rope marks, then that's kind of it. That means your time is nigh. Shit. Now this ghost, I remember this one. And I've, it took me ages, but I found the trick to this ghost. This ghost is blind. This ghost is blind. And uh, she reacts to hearing you. Now that's fine, but I didn't know this first time round. And the trouble with that, yep, she's going to charge, she's going to charge, yep, we're dead. Uh, that's okay, I don't mind, that's fine. But if you start running, she will attack you really fast. And I think when she goes down like that... She's going to attack. I don't want to take any risks with her. Yeah, I'm sure that's the... That's the one that you've got to be very careful with. She did loads of damage to me. Uh, first time round. Now... The mirror... Now, first time round as well. Um, she killed me so many times before I actually worked out. Oh, wait a minute. Now, I'm going to go reload my film. Because once you start having like less than 30 shots, that's not a lot. It really isn't. And if we're going to reload, we well, save. We might as well save, I suppose. There we go. Yeah, definitely fighting the ghosts better. But at the same time, I know we're going to fight harder ones later on. I know we're going to fight harder ones. How much XP do we have? 6,000 already. Uh, I mean, I guess that sounds like a lot, but it kind of isn't. I guess once you know the ghost attack patterns, I mean, that's what it's all about, which, uh, yeah, I mean, that's just gaming in general. Once you understand the patterns of what you're fighting, then, you know, shit gets significant. Oh, hello, there's something behind the well. Let's go grab that. Oh, right. Girl turning. Girl turning into what? Stone mirror. Right. Gonna save that fucker again. The... I... Th I think... Now, I'm gonna save this in a different slot because I want to test something uh, off camera. I think... I think you can only have one stone mirror at a time. So the fact that we've just kind of, like, used one up isn't actually the end of the world. And uh, I also think they respawn. Never knew there was a stone mirror there. That's sly. Okay. Now fighting. Uh, there is a fight coming up with a certain ghost. Um, and holy shit was did I find that hard. September 14th. In the materials of the uh, in the materials that Tomato gathered for me, there is a paragraph about five pieces of a mirror passed down through the Himuro family for generations. These pieces were said to seal off the Hellgate, Hellgate, and protect the region from a great disaster. They might have something to do with the current hellish situation. Well, maybe. 
Five holy mirrors in shrines around the area all broke in a very small earthquake the other day. When I heard about it, it gave me the idea for this next work of mine. I think I brought a news article about it with me when I came here. It says there were only five holy mirrors in existence. But according to some legends, there is another, the true holy mirror. The folklorist also mentions in his research documents, the ones I found here in the mansion... I think I dropped the research document somewhere when I was trying to escape that cursed woman. Uh, here are my theories. I think the five mirrors that were destroyed in the earthquake the other day had a role of watching over the true holy mirror. I don't think it was the earthquake that broke the five holy mirrors in the shrines. I think it was a signal that the seal on the hell gate that the Himuro true holy mirror provides had broken for some reason. The five mirrors were trying to warn us. Okay. Well, I mean, that makes a lot of sense in a gribbly, ghosty way. Okay. Yeah, I have a fondness for these PlayStation 2 graphics. I really do. All right. Yeah, I mean, oh god. I remember it was like well by this time that uh, I was on the verge of rage quitting <laughs> when I first played. Oh, standing there. The curse, you say? We are get oh wow, we've almost got enough again. Yeah. Whoa, warped man. That was worth one thousand two hundred and fifty. That was a lot. Okay. Can we check this wisp out? Yeah, you're already carrying the maximum number allowed for this item. Yeah, so you can only hold one stone mirror at a time. We've got some more Type 37 film. Okay. Oh, we're out of fucking time, guys. <laughs> uh, I know... You know what, let's do it. Oh. Oh. It reacted. Do I match the carvings to the characters, maybe? Uh, yes. Select stone. Oh, right, I see. Uh, yeah, I see how this shit goes down. So that goes there. Uh, that goes there. Nothing happens, I guess. Oh, right, do we only have... Oh, I see. We've only got four moves. Right. So that's got to go there. That's got to go there. That's got to go there. And that there. Okay. Black carving inserted. I guess she's just going to barge her way in there. But we can leave. <laughs> this is good. Because I'm going to go back and save it, guys. And we're going to go into that room in the next video. Because uh, I've got to go pick up the missus. And as much as I want to go through there... Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know that bit takes a little bit of time. So, yes. This game, I'm surprised. I'm not really... I mean... I am having certain amount of trouble with certain aspects of this game, but it's not as savagely difficult as I remember, and I don't know why. I, um, maybe I was, I don't know, frustrated, pissed off about something. I don't know what, but I'm actually kind of enjoying this right now. 
Um, so anyway, guys, we're going to leave it there. When we come back, I guess we're going to go up to that shrine thing. And I know we have a boss fight in there. And my pedigree chums, I can allude to you this. It was literally this bit that I gave up the game with, I'm sure. Um, because I remember I defeated the boss, but I, I had nothing left. I had no health. I had... Um, I definitely didn't have any... Well, I might have had one mirror, which would have been the one that I picked up outside the door. Uh, because I didn't know about the one behind the uh, mir uh, the well. And that actually is because of this cable. Uh, I remember the little flashing items when I was using a SCART cable before were so hard to actually see. on. And, well, the fact that I'm also using a 27-inch... PC monitor and before I was having a PlayStation 2 stretched across a 42 inch TV which didn't help um, I think that that was quite nice to actually see that there because I definitely didn't get that before um, so we actually have too many mirrors uh, <laughs> which is nice anyway yeah okay so I'm enjoying this game I really am enjoying this game um, so thanks for watching as always till next time